show permit today on Lake Cahoon uh, in Southern Virginia. All the details about the lake, the water type, and all that will be down in the description below. I'm out. I just got my first spot, so I'm gonna just try and hopefully get five. Um, not really a fan of this lake, but I'm here. So we're gonna try and get five. Uh, stay tuned. I'll give you guys updates throughout the day on how's it, how it's going and what I'm catching them on and stuff. And uh, yeah, so we'll we're gonna see how it goes. Hopefully, I can get a decent limit and have a decent day. Uh, I'm just gonna. This is actually not where I wanted to start. Somebody else started on my spot over there. So I'm gonna start here for a little while and then probably head back over there and then hit some other spots I know in this lake. Um, it's 46 degree water temp right now and it's actually kind of warm outside. I thought it was gonna be a lot colder than this, but it's warming up really quick. So uh, hopefully we can get a decent limit at least, get on a couple fish. But uh, yeah, stay tuned and I hope you guys enjoy the video. So, a little update is 9.45 uh, now. I haven't caught a fish yet. I've been around, pretty much kind of around four people throughout the day that have also not caught fish, at least from what I know. Uh, they could have, by now, because I kind of, you know, away from everybody, because uh, I'm at a cove, or at a little creek right now, but I've caught fish in before, I've caught a lot of fish in before. I've caught like a 15 pound limit in, 30 minutes in this creek, granted right that was in the spring. But that's, this creek is about the only good place on the lake, as far as I'm concerned. There's a couple other good places, but um, pretty much everybody had, went, went to the back where there's, uh, there's some like train trestles and it's like, it's really good back up in there in the summer. I don't know about this time of year, uh, but I haven't gotten even a single bite today. I've been throwing a Ned rig, a crankbait. I've been seeing a lot of fish on the uh, graph and I've been kind of stopping to just fish and see what happens and haven't gotten a single bite. I'm not even sure if they're bass. A lot of them are probably like catfish or something, but they're just sitting on the bottom in like 15 all the way to 20 feet of water. But uh, there's a bridge right there. I'm gonna fish this little creek and then I'm gonna hit that bridge. And then from there, I don't know, the water's warming up. It's 45, or it was 45, it's 47 and a half now. So. It's warming up relatively quick, and we have till four o'clock. They changed it from 2:30 to four. I'm not sure why, but I'm kind of glad they did because I think the last two, three hours are probably where the fish are going to be caught because this water's pretty cold. Uh, but it's warming up quick, so hopefully the fish turn on. And uh, there's a front coming in too, so hopefully that turns the fish on. But I don't know. It's been slow. It's been a grind. So hopefully I want to at least come back with a limit. I think. I think I could do it. It's just it's been a it's been a hard fought uh, battle today. One of my friends caught a 24 inch pickerel, so that was cool. So that's a citation pickerel for the state of Virginia. But um yeah, so I'm gonna get back to fishing and stay tuned for whatever happens next. Like I said, this little bank right here. I figured coming over here, it was a long paddle, but I figured I'd catch one. Uh, I was just throwing a little Ned rig. And he hit it and he did not let go. So hopefully I can get a couple more off this point. Uh, it was 11 and a half, so I definitely need to upgrade. But if I can get a 50 inch limit, I'll be happy with myself.